Right, so, it's ready. You're going up in it. Well, why do you not? Well, actually, one reason. You see the maximum weight, 159 kilograms. What's the... Well, you're not going anywhere, are you? Well, the camera is quite heavy. No, oh, okay, yes, the camera. Why? <laughs> This is a lot higher than it looked in the brochure. I wouldn't like that. <laughs> That's really horrible. Keep going until the end bit drops out. <laughs> Why don't you two... Yes? ..get in your cars... Yes? OK. ..and can I just reinforce one thing? What? Silence is key. Agreed. That ridge up there looks promising. Right. Where is it? No, 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 back a bit, back. I can't go back. I'll have to go all the way round. What? I can hear it from up here. Right, that one there, stop. Got it. Then it was May's turn to disturb the peace. What is that? It's a bird call. It's a duck. Moments later, though, there was an even worse noise. Oh, God. Jesus. If only there was something tall and metal that would attract the lightning. Not wishing to be fried, I quickly descended. And then we all tried to outrun the storm. Which didn't work. Jesus Christ. We're 250 miles from the equator. We're on a volcano and a severe hailstorm. The sky! The tail coming in now. Bending in through the back. Still, we've got some great condor photographs. Oh, look at this now. Life in the Jeep was hideous. Oh, God. Oh, oh, thank oh. oh, he's right down the back of my neck. Oh, I'm going to pull the ice down the back of my seat. Oh, bollocks. Richard was very sympathetic. Oh, dear. Oh, uh, that is a lot of snow. Oh, joy. Joyous man. Mercifully, though, the storm passed. So we drove down the rough and icy mountain track long into the night.